fleet group is jumping in three, two, one. Jump complete. Dratus contacts bearing 017, Karam 021. PyCon and the rest of the 12 colonies are watching our every move, Commander. Some would see Colonial Fleet fail. Ensure we succeed. No pressure, sir. No pressure at all. Okay, so it's been a bloody long time since we did uh, any kind of um, Battlestar Galactica videos, but here we are. We're back in Battlestar Galactica Deadlock. And for the first time, and for the only time for the next little while, we get our first look at a Battlestar. So we've got the Jupiter class, uh, which is the Athena, uh, which is base for PyCon, which is where we're orbiting. Um, okay. So... I think ultimately it's going to take a Onic, while Mander. for uh, this to get into range. So let's just keep them going fast Onic, if Mander. we can. Uh, let's pick what targets we may or may not have. So we've got three targets. One, two, three. Is there a fourth? No. So let's just go for the one for the middle because we don't quite know what it is. Um, for Daedalus, Launching let's alert vipers. Uh, launch the alert fighters. And again, we're, we're going to put our radar uh, as fast, uh, as far as possible for the ships so we can try and work out what we are looking at. We're just going to proceed nice and slowly. Um, and let's. What have we got here? Ah, okay, so we've got Raptors, Missile. Okay, cool. Right. Mm. Okay, so we've got a new ship new contact and it's small so this is possibly some kind of carrier ships are not lifeless assets to needlessly throw at the enemy commander adjust a ship's posture to tailor the crew's tactics <laughs> so that you can match whatever opposition you encounter I've actually already done that to be honest um, but for the sake of the tutorial let's just do it so if we do space posture. a defensive posture ensures the ship's defense oriented subsystems are more efficient Likewise, an aggressive posture will boost the ship's offensive capabilities at the expense of the ship's defenses. Cool. Happy days. Let's keep us on boost. Okay. So. Yes, sir. Here we go. Let's, um... Let's just be ready to launch the fighters when the time is right. In fact, this contact's coming in pretty fast towards us. But we've got we've got Dreda's contact on it now. Commander, receiving word from Athena's CAG. Their alert vipers are online and ready to return hostilities. Yeah, certainly just. So uh, again, tutorial. Let's just go through this squadrons. We'll launch all squadrons. Okay. We want Athena in attack mode. Uh, we are strongest and angriest On it, Commander. when facing forward. So actually, let's have the Battlestar come towards this one. We now have a good idea of what we're looking at, so we're just going to advance this ship over here. So we're going to focus fire onto this one when the time is right. We're going to move this into attack posture, and we're going to focus fire on this one when the time is right. Okay, enter. Woohoohoo! IFF confirms unit is hostile. Amazing! So we've got good line of sight on this one. Missiles incoming! Ah, this is about to get spicy. Use squadrons to hit priority targets or defend any of our own capitals. You can recall a squadron back to its carrier if the situation begins to deteriorate. Amazing! Okay, so... Uh, select the squadron. So we've got one Viper squadron here. Space. Select target. So let's have the Rapid. Uh Let's have this. Hmm, what do I want to do here? What do I want to do? What do I want to do? Uh, Let's have that. I don't fancy boarding anything at the moment, so let's just go and have it disarm this. No, no, no. Hmm. 
No disarmable targets nearby. Okay, well, that's, that's annoying. So we'll have the Raptor Squadron defend the Athena. Uh, let's have both of these Raptor Squadrons defend the, the, uh, the shipyards. Oop, and the second one. It's going to defend the shipyards. Happy days. Uh, we've got one more Raptor Squadron which is here and we are going to get them to select the target. Uh, squadron target is confirmed. This. Cool. Um, so the Athena we're going to have a focus fire on this. Um, what is its target solution like? Uh, we are within, within firing range. Okay, we are within firing range. So let's just slow this down as much as we can. Yes, sir. So a head slow for this one. This looks like a big beast, so let's just Missiles whap, on their way. whap some missiles into this bad boy. And are we within targeting range? Yes, okay, we've got good target lock. So a head slow on this one. And Yes, sir. Okay. We're gonna put you in defensive posture because those missiles are about to become spicy. And let's see how this turn plays. Lots of missiles, but ultimately not a lot of stuff. So their front armor is demolished, which is a pain. Uh, Raptor Squadron, I want you to boost the firewalls of the ship, because that's going to be quite important. Uh, Athena is going to continue ahead slow. Persis is going to continue ahead slow. Okay. Understood. But there's no considerable damage yet. Uh, let's try. Uh, so let's get um, some missiles on. Missiles this ship. on their way. Because it's quite far away. Right. Let's see how this proceeds. So the Talon has got no front armor and heavy damage to the front. No armor in the front. So its its biggest source of armor is gone. However, at the same time, our armor is starting to weaken. I want to keep this on. Yeah, I want to keep this on defense to boost the firewalls. Fighter squadron is taking fire. Right. Okay, so we now need to adjust this. So we're going to put this ship to one half to starboard. And we want the big guns kept on this, so we're gonna put this one. We're gonna put the Athena to again half to starboard. Uh, the firewall, so the firewall has now gone on this ship. So we're going to get it in position to. Uh, very well. We're gonna bring it back in line with the fleet. And uh, we'll have to deal with this at a later, at a later time. So let's end turn. See where we get to. Okay, Talon's about to go down. Commander, I've oh. asked Sinan if there is any way we can stop those Cylon tech ships from hacking our systems, but he's being stubborn. They've Delightful. already minimized onboard networking. Your firewall should keep them out for a while. Otherwise, take the subsystem offline for repairs if they cause too much damage. Or you can rely on the tried and tested method of shooting the Cylons down before they get the chance. Well, that's fair. Battle stars are equipped to accommodate flak ammunition. Use this to zone out fighters and incoming munitions. Cool. Yeah, so the flak thing is here. So you can select what side. Uh, but they are pretty good at shooting down your uh, your friends. So uh, let's maybe not do that. Right, okay. So I think what we're going to do here, 
we've got one turn left on all the missiles to go, so let's uh, let's put this on boost thrusters here. Uh, and let's have the Athena come on boost thrusters and hard to port. So let's get rid of this thing and then we'll go over and try and deal with this guy who's, you know, something something of miles away. So let's just let's just do that. That bugger! But there was two lots of beeping, so this could mean the Daedalus could be under about to be under attack, which indeed is correct. Okay. So the missiles are heading for the ship. Let's see if the ra we can't get the raptors to shoot them down. Because these raptors are about to come under quite spicy fire. Uh, sorry, vipers. I'm getting mixed up. Um, okay. So bring the ship around as fast as we can. Let's get this one as fast as we can. Okay, so yes, let's go sir. full rise. So let's just missile this prick out of the sky. Focus uh, missiles. Understood. Uh, our fire control is still offline here. We don't need this, so let's just try and boost thrusters. Actually, do you know what? What armor have we still got? So this, uh, it's coming from to the side and above. So our bottom armor is pretty well damaged, our front armor is half damaged, so we want the top armor. So we're going to face Onic, it, Commander. and we're going to let them hit into the top. Okay, cool. Right, end turn. Let's see how this gets on. So the Manticore, uh, the Lancer is going to hard about, and good, we mitigated all the damage from that, so that's fine. Sir, PyCon Intel just confirmed that Admiral McKinley died in the attack on Fleet HQ. Mm, With Admiral Sarkis still missing aboard Galactica, Admiral Kane remains the commanding officer of Colonial Fleet. Also McKinley tragic. was a good commander and a good soldier. We honor his memory today. So say we all. So say we all. Okay, as cute and nice as that is, uh, we actually do have a war ongoing, which is interesting so missiles are done let's try and raise this back up uh, let's get the manticores over here and uh, the okay so what we're gonna do for Athena is we're gonna take boost off and we're gonna bring us about so the Athena is gonna take ages to go anywhere it's such a, a long ship uh, that it's gonna take ages to do anything so we want it to go as fast as possible. It can maneuver better when it's not got a boost to its thruster, so we'll do that and then we'll, we'll do the boost. Okay, this ship's starting to come about which quite a bit, which is interesting. So this could get spicy fast. So we've got enough control of fire control back, which is good. Okay, so let's do that one. Let's cut yes, hard about. What side's it on? It's on. The Dickens is it? Where the Dickens is it? Okay, that's fucking miles away. Fair enough. Fair enough. So missiles are about to hit. Good. So we only got one missile locking on. So we want to chase up on this as fast as possible uh, and bring this one bring this one around as well. So let's make sure our focus fire is on because we want rid of the ship as much as possible. Actually, do you know what? Let's take boost off. Okay, uh, boost off. Ah, more missiles. Great. So this sh these ships are heavily. This ship is now heavily damaged, so say we which all. is good. Uh, 
firewall is doing stuff, which is fine. Right, let's now get the Athenon boost. As much use as that actually is. So the Raptors are now going to come out and try and get rid of the ammunition, which we've got one, two, three, four. We've got four of them. Two to Daedalus go. Daedalus is taking damage. Okay, good. Good. So this one's over. Okay. So what we're going to do here... Uh, um, right. So, Raptor Squadron attack. Raptor Squadron attack. Nope, sorry, Viper Squadron. Viper Squadron attack. Viper Squadron attack. Raptor Squadron attack. Okay, that's all those ships sorted. Uh, Daedalus is, requires some repairs. It's taking just a smidgen of damage, which is fine. Um, Athena is going to continue steaming as yes, fast Commander. as it can go, which is not fast at all. These two ships are now the cause of our concern, so we're going to put them uh, back onto boost, because these are still really manoeuvrable on boost, the Manticore class. So the Persis is going to boost and hard to port. The Lancer is now going to boost, and we don't need this, so we'll, we'll repair that while we're going. And again, hard to port. All units accounted for, and turn. Okay. Subsystem is back online. So our Vipers are going to continue attacking the capital ship while we get our yes, sir. other ships in place. And... Understood. Let's go. Oh, uh, we've actually got a good firing angle here. Understood. So let's fire one on this side. Fire one on this side. And we don't have a good firing angle here. So let's just leave that one be. So unlike turrets... Um, the missiles do not have a good chance of hitting the Vipers, which is helpful. So let's just keep this going as fast as we can. Cool. So as soon as the Athena is clear of the Daedalus, which it almost is, but I'm not happy enough to do it now. Ah, shit, missiles away. But we still have a chance to do this, but it's a slim chance. Uh, okay. So we're gonna get these ones to defend the Daedalus. And you defend Daedalus. Defend Daedalus. Okay, so we want to try. We want to try and intercept these missiles. I don't think we are actually going to do it. Uh, Athena is now going to fire its missiles. And we're going to bring us yes, up slightly. Cool. Happy days. Right. Let's see how this gets on. I don't know if we can stop this anymore. Missiles incoming. One, two, no, no. no. Daedalus is taking damage. No, nope, we couldn't really stop them. But the fight's now done. So yeah. this is cold. All hostile contacts are cleared. Kill. If you're finished playing with Pycon's toy, I believe it's time to hand Athena over to their defense ministry. Excellent. So we They've didn't... already been notified, Sinan. Commander, there's something else. We're having some difficulty with Daedalus's navigation computers. It'll be easier to explain from the war room. Cool. So that's the campaign doing campaign stuff. Let's watch this fight back and see how we get on. 